More than 90 first responders will be added to the city's payroll if the city council approves the budget proposed by city manager Mark Ott. New at noon, our city reporter Reagan Hackleman joins us live from City Hall to explain what all the numbers mean. Reagan? Hey guys, sorry about this, but it is a little wet out here, so we're having to improvise. We are at City Hall, and the good news is that the proposed budget has been balanced. Now, the city manager started the meeting off this earlier, telling city council that he is delivering his proposed budget with a smile. Now, the reason he had a smile is because he and his staff were able to close a projected budget shortfall of between 11 and $28 million. So let's take a closer look at the numbers now. The total budget for the city of Austin is $2.8 billion for the enterprise funds and the general fund. Those enterprise funds include Austin Energy, Austin Water Utility, the general fund fund, which is what you and I use, is $650 million. Now, this year's budget includes money for 48 additional police officers, 30 paramedics, and 10 additional firefighters. Now, the question that you all want to know is how much is this going to cost you in taxes? Property tax increase this year will be 1.9% above what it was last year. For someone who owns an average home in Austin, and by average, we mean $184,000, that's how much your home is worth, you will see a $4.37 increase per month in your property taxes. We are in better shape than we expected to be. Uh, we're not uh, increasing the property tax rate as much as we thought we were going to have to. We're not increasing our enterprise fund fees as much as we thought we were going to have to. But we're still talking about substantial increases in property taxes and some increases in our enterprise fund fees. Now, next up is a series of public meetings. Those meetings take place starting on August 19th, and they also take place on August 26th. Those are normal council meetings. Those public meetings will be about 1030 in the morning. And, of course, the city council has the final say on this proposed budget. So we can expect a little playroom over the next month with exactly what this budget will look like. They are scheduled to approve that budget on September 13th. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to go inside where it's dry. Sally and Chris, back to you. <laughs> All right. You go and do that, Reagan. Reagan, thank you.